First one, absolutely. Okay, so what that means is to be square, if I want to make a save, and I want to make a save to that pylon, the first thing I need to do is square my body so I'm square, which means everything is lined up perfectly, okay? So my body, my, my toes, my hips, my nose, my chest, everything is looking at that pylon. That's square, okay? So what's the second most important thing? There's three things I'm looking for. Square is number one. What's number two? Angles, maybe? Pardon? Angles, maybe? And did you study ahead of time? You're pretty good. Pretty good. Then maybe. Angles. All right. So we get square first, then we get our angle. So what does our angle mean? Yeah? Well, your angles, the further you are, and like the more that you challenge, the smaller you are your angles get, and you want your angles to be as small as possible. Because okay. the smaller your angles are, the less that they have to shoot at. Okay, not bad, not quite. So what you're talking about is challenging in depth, okay? So you might be jumping ahead to number three, but you need one, one, okay? But angle, so this is the middle of our net. The angle is, are we straight from the middle of our net to the, to the target that's shooting at us, right? So this is the, the right angle on this one. This one over here, the angle is going go this way, right? So for me, if I've made a save over here, and the next shot is coming from that pylon, the first thing I'm gonna do is get square, okay? Then I'm gonna find my angle, and then I'm gonna find my depth, okay? So there's three things, it's square, then it's angle, then it's depth. So the reason for that is if I go from here, and I wanna get my depth first, and I come to here, it's a farther move, okay? So from here to here, I can measure this out. But if I'm standing here and I go to straight across, it's a shorter distance than it is for me to go up to the top. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Yes. Does that make sense, Charlie? So I want to take the shortest distance I can to get the angle first, and then if I've still got time, then I'll come out. So as you get to be faster, you can start doing them at the same time. So you can come from here, and you can teach push and get kind of halfway, right? Okay? But the main thing is that when you get there, you're stopped, you're ready, you're balanced to make a save. Okay? So what we're going to do on this drill is we're going to start here, we're going to go out, square up to the first one. That's it. You're just going to be nice and square. And then come back to your net. You come to the middle, and you come out, square up to this one. Back to the middle, come to the wall, turn the edge, square up to this one. Back in, come back to the middle. That's it. Super easy, okay? But we're going to videotape you guys. We're just going to repeat it over and over and over again. We just want to see you move in the net, okay? So let's move. Oh, we can leave one here. Put one over there. 